Hey yo, what's up? It's Mr. Proper96 here, and today I've got another VGC 2012 battle for y'all to watch today. And today it is against no one else but. That's right, KW1298. Yeah, I know. So, um, yeah, um, I was hosting a little bit of a tournament for some of my friends, and he, he entered it. So, um, yeah, we're facing each other in the second round. And, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go right into his team. So I can see that he has a very, very, very standard team. He's got the Suicune and the Zapdos for a possible Tailwind support. He has the Chandelure and Cresselia for possible Trick Room support, and he has decently slow Pokemon in order to function in Trick Room and Tailwind. So, um, hmm. See, I'm afraid of the Tailwind, so I am actually going to go out into my Mesprit first. Um, that way I can set up a Trick Room against the, um, against the Suicune or the Zapdos, or counteract their Trick Rooms, the Chandelures and the Cresselia's Trick Rooms. Or, if he wants to go ahead and go for the um, Thunder Wave, I can go ahead and um, go for the Trick Room, and then my guys um, are pretty much faster than all of his um, in Trick Room and Paralyzed. So, also looking at his team, I can see that Swampert is going to be very helpful, considering he, has, he can um, do a lot of damage he has super effective moves to one, two, three, four of his guys. So I need to keep him in the back because he is very valuable to this. Um, he's going to be very valuable to this battle. So also I'm going to need to include Bisharp in order to counter the Cresselia and to counter the um, Chandelure. And also he does not have anybody to resist my Sucker Punches. And also I think um, now it's just a matter of what I want to put in. I don't think Verizian is going to be able to do much can, looking at his team other than to the Suicune. But also, I may want to put it in just to one-hit KO the Suicune. But um, I think that maybe a, maybe Crobat will help. Um, actually, no, I am going to go into Verizian, expecting him to go with the Suicune lead. Okay, so he did indeed go for that. So I'm going to go for the Trick Room and the Leaf Blade and see how that works out for me. Because hopefully one of them will set up a Tailwind, and then all my guys are going to be faster than his because he's going to be incredibly fast, but he's also going to be in a Trick Room, so he's going to be incredibly slow. So hopefully that works out for me if I predicted him properly, and hopefully also a Leaf Blade will do a lot of damage. If he sets up Tailwind, yep, like I expected, he set up the Tailwind, and now that's going to bite him in the butt. So I set up the Trick Room, so now my guys are faster. And now I'm going to, just going to clean up, I guess you could say. And the Heat Wave, since Verizing is such a good wall, he's going to be able to take that really well. And my mess rig did avoid it, but I don't think it really mattered that much because it would have been able to take it even better. So I'm going to go for another Ice Beam and a Leaf Blade and see how that works. Um, so far, this is going really, really well. Um, yeah, he's got a very standard team. I'm actually kind of surprised. No offense, Kevin. But, um... Yeah, he does. It's kind of weird seeing him with a very standard team, considering he uses very non-standard Pokemon for a lot of his battles um, for singles. So, um, yeah, this is looking very, very good in my favor. Um, yeah, he's taking a very long time. Okay, there we go. And I did get a critical hit. Man, that's unfortunate. I'm sorry. I got a punch. Okay, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Okay, so I'm going to go for the Ice, actually. I'm going to go for the Psychic and the Sacred Sword. Let's see, actually, no, I'm going to go for the Leaf Blade because it has a higher chance to get a critical hit. I know that's not really a good, a good thing to rely on, but I'm not really relying on it. I'm just going for the move over the other because it has a high critical hit ratio and because they have the exact same um, base power. So, let's see how that works. Okay, that was a very good play, actually. He um, protected in order to stall out his own Tailwind, that way he, his Chandelure can outspeed my Verizian in a Trick Room. So now I'm going to Psychic his Chandelure, hoping, hoping to kill him, which it should, um, considering I do have um, a little, a decent amount of um, special attack investment into my Mesprit, and I'm going to go for the Leaf Blade on the Garchomp, see how that does. 
And even if he switches in the Suicune, I will be able to do a lot of damage to him. Oh, he was faster than me. Wow. See? And then I crit his Guard Chomp with a Leaf Blade. Well, I do not think it really mattered an incredible amount because of the fact that if I went for... If um, it didn't crit, I would be able to go into Bisharp and one-hit KO with a Sucker Punch or Swamper to one-hit KO with an Ice Punch. And... Yeah, it didn't really matter that much. Even the heat wave avoid, I could have, I could have done something to prevent it and whatnot. Okay, I'm gonna go for the trick room again, cause why not? Uh, I'm just gonna try. Yeah, he, yeah, he was smart enough to not let me set up trick room again. So yeah, that was, that was a very good game, Kevin. So yeah, it went really well. Yeah, just protect. Why not? You should protect again. That would be funny. You should protect again. I dare you. Ah, oh, now protect again. Yeah, why did he go for a protect? Dang! Come on! He would have done nothing to help him, but still, it would have stalled out the match a little bit longer. <sighs> yeah. That would have been a waste of turns. So. That was a good game, Kevin. Um, everybody, please comment and like and subscribe to this channel. Um, also, about the commenting, comment down below about um, how I can improve my commentary. I was a little bit, I don't know, a little bit choppy at the beginning of this. So, um, yeah, just tell me what I can do to um, make my commentary better. And please subscribe to this channel. And also, feel free to give us a like. Um, it always helps. So, yeah, goodbye, everybody.